Hi everyone, my name is Adrian, I'm the owner of ASA Watches and today I would like to talk with you about adjusting the movement in different positions. You might have heard um, from, from other watch brands in the industry about adjusting the watch in five or six positions. So to start, the six positions are dial up, dial facing up, dial down and the crown in four positions. Crown to the right, crown on the top, crown to the left, crown down. So these are the six positions that um, people measure the performance of the watch. But you can cancel out one, for example, the uh, position crown to the right for the viewers. Because if you wear your watch on the left, this is a very unnatural position or like this. It's not how you, how you use your watch during the day. So the performance of the, of the watch can be measured on a, on a witchy device. Here I positioned um, 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 an ETA movement and this is how you measure the timing in all the positions. Dial down, dial up and the crown in different positions. It uses a small microphone to measure the, the ticking of the watch which gives the, gives the, the machine the daily rate. So why is this important? because the performance of the movement will be different in different positions. For example, if you hold the watch dial up or dial down, the balance wheel, uh, which is ticking, is only creating friction on the downside due to the weight of the, of the balance wheel pushing on the tip of the pinion on one side. If you wear your watch like this, the balance wheel is ticking this way and it's hanging into the two bearings which create more friction and uh, making the balance wheel, uh, making the amplitude of the balance wheel lower. That's why usually the amplitude of these two positions are the same, and in these four positions this will be slower. So why do they measure in these six positions? Because uh, when you wear a watch during the day, you will hold it in, in many different positions, and the goal is to um, create um, a timing which is as close as possible to zero on an average use of the watch during the day. Thank you all for watching and uh, I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to subscribe.